Well, Mark, you can't fault that performance. It was one of the better ones of this season. A bit reminiscent of, say, the Salford away game or Leighton Orient, but not quite the result you were looking for. Oh, we, we were looking for a result. We got a result, but not what we deserved. We deserved to win the game. We totally dominated from start to finish. We, we controlled the game with the ball and we produced opportunities in and around the penalty area. Um, we didn't take him, so maybe that's a confidence thing, but hopefully that goal from George can give everybody a bit of confidence and we can move on. Nice to see you though, especially in the first half, the space that was being created by some of your players, getting down the flanks, coming back in, back to the, the stuff we've seen so often before this run. Yeah, but you see the pitch is perfect, you know, so we have to, we can, we can do that away from home, you know, we can get our goalkeeper on the ball and, and play between their strikers and create overloads all over the pitch which we did today but we should have scored more than one goal we had some great opportunities to to play that final pass and, and put people in on goal or roll the ball across the six yard box for a tap in but we didn't do it. Is that a confidence thing again a bit of a lag from, from the run we're on I mean Aaron could Collins be. there was a great save to deny him in the first half yeah. a couple of good saves in the second half Yeah it could be like I said that, you know we you know I'm, I don't want to sort of castigate the players but the forward boys are in the team to create and score what, whatever sort of culmination of forwards we've used we've not done that consistently enough um, so we'll keep searching and we'll keep trying to play and we'll keep hopefully we are you know over George getting that goal today give him some confidence and he has to come into the to the picture, so it's looking to start again. I'm sure the fans can hear it while they're listening to this video. How much did that the weather play a part in how you had to play and how you had to adapt to the game? I'm, I'm so pleased the way the boys played in that in those conditions. They kept the ball on the floor. Like I said, we, we comp controlled the tempo the whole game. And I think they had one shot in the first half that hit the bar. It was a bit of a fluke. Um, and they had one shot in the second half which they scored from. Um, which we need to do better with not, not every shot the opposition have should end up in the back of our net and it was a soft goal but we limited them to very little five changes to the side today what did you make of, of those changes in the players who did come in I, I thought we played really well on the whole but we need to do better in forward areas uh, which was clear today and and we need to stop giving away really soft goals when we're in total control of the game. George Williams, how pleased for him are you, especially as it was against Oldham yeah. that he suffered a leg break on the opening day of the season? Yeah, pleased for him. It's so ironic, isn't it, that it's, um, it's against Oldham. A horrific tackle, first game of the season, and he's come back and, and punished them today. And just wish he'd have scored that last one at the end that got deflected that was going in the bottom corner. There were chances at the end, weren't there? Is that is it those little fine margins of game we talk about before? Yeah, but I'm convinced that will turn. You know, we'll you know we'll get one, we we'll get another, and we'll, we'll go. We can go on a run with with the quality we've got. We can go on a run, but we've got to be able to finish our chances off. And a week now between now and the Scunthorpe game, does that help get on the training pitch, get a little bit more work into them, get that confidence maybe? Well, hopefully we can get on the training pitch. With <laughs> hopefully, a, with yeah, the, they've done well down at Chippenham. All, yeah, <laughs> Chippenham have been fantastic and uh, I don't even think they'll be able to sort us a pitch out this week, but <laughs> we'll try, we'll try. <laughs>